I said early on I was going to highlight this play, and I want to do it even though I literally it's the next play after a long breakdown I just did. A lot you love here. Um, so Andrew Rame, you're going to be head up with Alfred Collins. I can't I, – I don't think Rame really turns him, but as soon as Collins makes a move to Rame's right shoulder to Collins' left here, you know, I guess going this way if you want to make it make it obvious what I'm saying here. Wow, that's a great arrow. Yeah. Um, he, he lets him go. He just kind of gives him a soft shoulder. Collins runs himself right out of the play. The the two, the, the big block here is Caden Green on Baron Sorrell. And Caden's just going to run him upfield. Uh, Rouse does a nice job with Jalen Ford, just manhandles him and turns him outside. Jalen Ford was not the impact guy in this game I expected him to be. Um, and the really, the sneaky thing that I don't think everyone's going to notice is the guy that should fill this and be perfect for this to stop this play is Jaron Thompson, the safety who, who had a game. He's probably going to want to forget drop the pick. He was the guy that was in front of Nick Anderson on the, on the big touchdown. I mean, you know, or the, I guess the game winning touchdown. Um, but right here, I mean, and it's not that he's doing something wrong here. It's just, you know, the way it plays out at the snap, Stogner's going to come down looking for a wham block. Well, clearly, you know, man, 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 and clearly Stogner is his. So when Stogner moves this way, Thompson moves with him and it takes him out of the run lane and Tawi Walker is able to just run underneath him. Uh, let, let's watch it here for a second. We'll clear the screen. So look, okay. So here goes Stogner headed this way. Thompson's going to follow him. Look where Thompson is when Walker hits the hole. He's overcommitted, and now Walker has room to run. This drive didn't come to anything. If I'm, I can't remember exactly, but I think they go three and out from here. If I'm not mistaken, I think this this was the only play. They got, no, no, that's not right. Obviously, I think this is the missed field goal. Sorry, it all runs together a little bit on me. We all know I'm I'm poor about those kind of things. Um, but this run is so huge because you're back there. I can't even imagine how loud it is with, you know, in that Texas end zone there. But again, so I want to highlight not just that. Watch Caden Green here. Uh, guys, this is your starting left guard. I, I, I don't think there's any question. I know listening to Brent Venable's comments on Monday night with the media, he talked about seeing Caden as a, you know, a starting level caliber player. Well, I, I, I think that day's here. Um, just watch him just turn. As soon as he does, he uses that big, strong right arm. Baron Sorrell's not part of the play. Here you've got, like I said, Walter Rouse hooked up on Jalen Ford. Boom. That's just a good football play all the way around. Tawi Walker. I fought it. I fought it for a while. Tawi Walker's got to be OU starting running back. He's the only guy they get any production with. And especially if you're going to do these things they're doing with Dylan Gabriel, he's a really nice compliment. He's a sledgehammer up the middle that other teams have to respect to the point that you're going to get those ends pinching in just a little bit to give Dylan, Dylan Gabriel the room he needs to run around outside the play for those wondering what that big noise was i just spilled water all over myself because even when i'm not being videoed i talk with my hands a lot so anyway just a, a nice play for the sooners and now i have to dry myself off